<laughs> I'm a grateful believer in Jesus Christ today. And my name is Lloyd Burton. And, and um, the Wings of Freedom program saved my life. It saved this guy's life right here. One of my brothers in the program. Yeah. We're, we're like, do, we're doing big stuff here. So what got me here was, what got me here was a lifetime of drug abuse. Yeah. The lifestyle that goes with it, the destruction that comes. I lost my family. Would you say a lot of isolation? Oh, Did my, you isolate? My whole life I isolated. I was, uh, <laughs> okay. I was abused as a child. So early on, I developed a distrust for mankind. And I didn't want to be anybody's friend because that, that was non-existent. There was no such thing as love. Okay, that's, that's how I grew up. Mm. And, and so, so I started using, when I was about 11 years old, drinking and, and smoking pot and meth, cocaine, LSD, gasoline, pain. I mean, I was a garbage pail junkie. 2017, I was introduced to this program. I was a homeless, an IV drug user, homeless right here on the street, sleeping in backyards and in bar ditches, just wherever I, wherever I could feel safe. Mm. And, uh, you know, once I got in, I did really good until my mom got sick. And my mom, my mom fell ill in 2018 and, and she wound up, she wound up passing. And I didn't handle it very good. So when they checked me into the hospital, my wife was with me. She'd gotten out of prison and we were, we were about, we were about six months into a relapse that time and uh, when, the, when I went into the hospital man they, they put me on antibiotics and I and I remember crying out to God because I didn't want to die you know when, when, when it's when it's when it's on you when it's on you it's scary you know and I cried out to him man and he heard me you know, he heard me, and, and he delivered me, and, and people say they've been delivered and set free, you know, but, but when, I, when, <laughs> when I came out of that hospital seven days later, I didn't want any dope, I didn't want a drink, I didn't want any, any of that, I just wanted God, mm -hmm. and, and I never wanted him before. I'd never wanted him before, but something happened in me when I cried out to him. Something happened, and 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 he delivered me. I didn't go through any withdrawal. My wife didn't either. We both have the same clean date. We didn't suffer withdrawal. We didn't go through any kind of detox. Okay, I haven't had a drink in almost five years. I haven't had a drink since 2018. Heard me and he said, "Okay, so if you're, you know, here, and you just gave me grace, man. So, so I called Dixie, you know, and I asked him for my spot back because I left. I left the program. You know, I thought, I thought I knew something. You know, but but man, he didn't even hesitate. He said, "Yeah, come on." You know, and I've been right here ever since. I've been right here ever since. Yeah. I try to represent him today. Some days it's hard. But this, this, this is hard. Like I said, it's a labor of love. That's why I'm 